point A is reflected across the origin, what will the coordinates of the result what will be the coordinates of the resulting point? Now as you can see we have point A over here. It's located at point six, negative three. Now there are several reflect reflections they may ask us to do. One could be reflecting across the x-axis, another reflecting across the y-axis, and in this case reflecting across the origin. Let's start by reflecting across the x-axis. Now we know that our x-axis here is horizontal from left to right. So what that means is we're going to take the same point A and we are going to reflect it on the opposite side of the x-axis. So it would keep its value of 6 in the x value, but its y value would become 3. So reflecting this point across the x-axis would give it a value of 6, 3. Now let's say we want to reflect it across the y-axis. Well, our y-axis goes up and down, so reflecting this point across the y-axis, it would keep its same y value of negative 3, but then its x value would move over to negative 6, giving it a value of negative 6, negative 3. And last, we could reflect this point A across the origin. Hang on just one sec here. When we reflect it across the origin, that means that it is going to flip its value on both the um, x value and the y value. So, it will have an x value of negative 6 over on this line and a y value of positive 3. Notice how it takes both it, how it takes the uh, both the reflected points and they kind of create a rectangle all together when you plot them. So when we reflect this across the origin, it has an x value of negative 6 and a y value of positive 3. For the correct answer, negative 6, 3.